Hello. Have you seen this that I'm wearing today? Pink coal shine. Um, we do tend to film a couple of videos at a time, so apologies if you've already seen me wearing this. I do try and, and spice things up a little bit. Now, we're going to take you through my knitting bag today. Um, I've been quite naughty since the start of 2019, and I do keep starting things. So I thought we'd give you a bit of an update of what's been going on in here. So, I'm... Something's rattling in it. Amy just said to me, are there any surprises in your bag? So I'm not entirely sure, so something's rattling. So... I was away last week. Ah, TikTok, there you go. It's always a little bit of a surprise in what in these bags. I was away last week and I wanted something really, really simple to do because we were flying, then we were driving and so on. So, and I was with Madeline, my youngest daughter, who talks more than I do, which is quite a feat. So, I like to have something I can just pick up and put down. So, I left work the night before, as I often do, with something new. And this was the result of my week away. Now it's not entirely finished, it's shapey as well. These are the colours that I've got left to do. I'm hoping I'll finish it this week. Um, I alternate knitting and crochet at night because I'm having some problems with my shoulder. Um, so I'm trying to, and my hand, so I'm trying to do, to alternate it a little bit. Um, so this was what I was doing whilst I was away and I was just crocheting, which did give me an aching hand, but there you go. This is the My Story Shawl on the Look What I Have Made blog, Deirdre Use. Now, Deirdre is a great friend of ours, um, super, super, super fun, love spending time with her. Um, and this, she had this when they came to do a Shapies Day last year, and she had it in a few different colours, and I loved it, it's just so easy to wear. Um, so yeah, this hopefully you'll see me sporting this around the craft barn soon. So that was in that bag with my Tic Tacs. Now this has been in here for a while. So I think I know what this is, oh yeah. I've got an empty box. Oh, oh, Amy. Oh, there's chocolate left. That never happens in my house. There's never usually chocolates left in my bag. I must have obviously been hiding them from somebody. So there's a box of matchmakers. Now this is, oh, Rico, Colour Love. Um, which is just stunning. And I've started, I started this a few weeks ago, actually. Look at the colour of that. This is, gosh, it's a while since I picked this up. I've made, this is the third one of these I've made. It's a blend of mohair and silk. It's so, so soft, and look at that. There's definitely a thing with cakes going on with me at the moment, but look at that for the colour change. Just the most perfect, perfect um, size ball to make a great granny. I have to say, this is the third one I've made in this yarn, um, and it's so soft and gorgeous, so I must get round to finish that. I'm going to pop my, them back so nobody in the office sees them. She has to pinch them. Now, oh, right. Now this, look at that colour. This is Debbie Bliss, oh, that one's fallen apart, Falkland Aran, uh, which we've got in our clearance section at the moment and is just lovely. And just a really, really simple blackberry stitch cowl. Um, again, something, I'm really busy at the minute, so I've not seen how much brain capacity to, oh, drop to stitch, to concentrate on anything. Um, so I'm just doing some really, really simple designs. Now that is it wound up, so that was that one. Now, I'll show you what else I've got. Look at those that seem to have made it home. Um, you'll have seen the zigzag short scarf that I've made, and I'm obviously thinking of doing another one, and I just keep picking up random balls. But I've got my mum making one in purple, and that looks really nice. I think I was tempted to look at those two together, but I think actually they might be too similar to what I've already got. But there you go. But that is um, Head Over Heels Sock Yarn from Stylecraft. That's in there. Oh, another whirl. That was as a choice with the slice of cherry pie because I wasn't sure which one to use. I think I've seen a shawl um, by a designer on Ravelry and on Instagram, Lisa Attic, that I really like that will be gorgeous in that. And then it's just some needles and lots of notebooks for work. So there you go, that's what's in my bag today.